is Rafi Media Villa from criticologos.com. First, Brandon and Pipa, thank you for taking a little bit of your time to talk about this amazing series. I, I, I was absolutely surprised by it. I wasn't expecting it to really just dive into it as I did. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you for watching. So I, let's talk about, let, Brandon, let me talk about Josh first. Uh, because Josh, in the beginning, and, and I don't want to enter into too many details here, but Josh, in the beginning, he could put, put an end to all of it pretty fast. He knew what Becky was trying to do um, and what she was doing. So I think what I want to know, in your opinion, why he why he, he let her on? Why, why, she, why he let her on? Why he why did he just came into what she was trying to do? Uh, I think I think uh, because Josh is very infatuated by who Becky is and uh, the game that she's playing. Uh, not only does he has a very um, um, emotional connection with her, but he also wants to see how this is going to play out for her. Um, and in a, in, a, in a side sense as well, he wants to be the safe haven for her. He's constantly reminding her to like, hey, watch this, watch out for this, watch this trap here, um, but also gives her the space to, to, to do what she wants to do and not judge her in the process. So I think the reason why he doesn't give her up is because he likes her at the, at the mm -hmm. ultimate core of it. He actually really likes her. Uh, uh, Pippa, let's talk about Lydia and and I, I, same same situation with Josh. I mean, in a, in a sense that obviously we don't know the whole story here with who Sasha is or who she's saying she is. Obviously, but uh, is, do you think, in your opinion, that that that, that Lydia was being naive? Uh, she wasn't giving giving her too much credit for what he was she was selling uh, uh, with the story. I mean, I think yes and no. I think Alice and I had a conversation in prep about how Livia has never had any successful female relationships. And I think that's why she's all in at the beginning with this friendship with, with Sasha. She wants to, I suppose she wants to prove to herself that she can do it. She can have female friends. Um, maybe she is a little bit naive, but I also think she, <laughs> but I also just think she's just, but I also think she's kind of quite taken with this, woman who's come into her life and is is sort of making that transition to having another female friendship really easy mm. i i just this the story when this thing that i loved i think that i loved about the story the most is social media is in the center of everything and today in today's life social media is part of our life part of our daily lives that we, that we cannot escape from it i think my question should be for the both of you why can people take away from the story? Why do you expect people to take away from the story? Uh, people to first, you first. I think there's, I mean, I think we've, we've said that there's, it opens up a lot of conversations about how one approaches using social media, the good side, the bad side, because it's not all bad, it's not mm. all good. Um, and I also think there's something really relatable in Becky's use of social media. I mm. think that people will go, oh my God, that's what I do. <laughs> God, yeah. oh God, that's what I do. You know, and they might kind of, like you said earlier, put the mirror, it, put, it, shines a, it puts a mirror mm -hmm. on people, which will either be uncomfortable or comfortable. And I think mm -hmm. either is good. You know, I don't think this is a show where you should be walking. It's, there's no sort of yellow brick road at the end. There's no, no bow tied securely. Mm -hmm. I think you should, it, it, I think if it leaves you feeling a bit uncomfortable, then we did our job. We did our job, yeah. Mm -hmm. Brandon, something you want to add? Um, no, I, Pippa hit it right on the head. That's that's exactly what we want to take what we want people to take away, and also to feel at the very end of the show, at the end of the uh, the series, is that uh, we want you to really question how social media affects your life individually. Yeah, you know. So so yeah. Again, uh, I think I'm out of time. Thank you for the two of you for your time. Congratulations. Uh, both of you did great. And, and, and Brandon, you know, not that, not that other part. I absolutely love what you did. Thank you. I congratulate oh, thank you once again. Thank you so much. Muchas gracias. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Gracias.